Okay, Ian, let's go back to Monday. We all saw Devontae Adams after the heartbreaking loss there for the Raiders. The fourth down pass falls incomplete. He's running up the tunnel, running off the field after the Raiders lose, and he shoves a guy. A guy working on the field, identified by some as a cameraman, regardless, a member of the TV crew there, shoved him to the ground. That guy was taken to a hospital, has now filed a police report. And Ian, we now have the next step in this, which is charges? Yeah, a citation for assault for Devonte Adams. Meanwhile, the NFL continues to look into this, uh, continues to weigh discipline, and it certainly seems like some sort sort of discipline is expected for Devonte Adams. What we do not know is is there going to be a suspension, which would mean, of course, Devonte Adams and the Raiders on a bye this week would mean he's out the following week, or is it just going to be? A hefty fine and you know usually you find out that news on a Wednesday morning with the Raiders not being uh, not playing this week there's a little more time for the NFL to sort it out meanwhile Devontae Adams has apologized a couple times and Josh McDaniels the Raiders head coach has stood behind him as a person there you see Devontae Adams apology we'll see if that is something that factors into the NFL's decision or not as we still await word on what they're going to do this is an interesting one because a lot of times when you've got a player in a legal situation, the league will let the legal process play out before they decide for a potential suspension. But in this case, I mean, it was all caught on video. You don't need the legal process to play out for you to make a judgment on what happened. You've got it all right in front of your eyes here. Now, again, there's no rush because the Raiders don't play this weekend. Usually by now, we would have a decision. We would be into the appeals process if the player was going to be suspended. The NFL taking its time uh, to render a decision here because, again, there is no great rush to get it done before this weekend.